What's going on guys? T-Mart here and the release of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is among us. Yes, that's right. It's very, very exciting. Since I'm able to upload this video a little bit before the game comes out, I wanted to let you guys know what I personally think is the best weapon to start off with by far in this game. I want to have you guys have a nice transition period into this game. There's so much to think about, so many weapons and perks and attachments and stuff to unlock. I just want to help you guys out and let you guys know what you should be starting off with to get accustomed to the game, to get a feel for the maps, and to, uh, to have a nice, solid, good start to your advanced warfare careers. The gun I'm talking about is the AK-12. You can see me using it right here. This is one of the two assault rifles you automatically have unlocked from level one when you first load up the game. There's this one as well as the VAL-27. So I definitely think assault rifles are the way to go when you first start playing the game. First of all, the lines of sight in this game are, are a little bit longer, you know, typically. So you're definitely gonna benefit with an AR in that regard. But then also when you first play a game, typically you wanna kinda patrol the edges of the map, keep your back to a wall and get a feel for things. You don't wanna run out in the middle of the map where there's a million different ways to get shot from when you don't know what to expect. You don't know where you're going. You don't know the different lines of sight and the different routes and things like that. So you typically wanna play it a little bit slower with your back to a wall when you're first starting off. So ARs definitely help you there. Now. There are a couple of reasons why I like the AK-12 more than the BAL-27, especially when you're first starting off. Number one of which is the iron sights are out of this world on the AK-12. They're so good. So uh, it's just kind of like a, a circle with a vertical line down the middle. There's nothing really blocking your view. You know, aiming down sight is absolutely not a problem with this thing. As well as I think it only takes like 20 kills to unlock the red dot sight and like 10 kills while aiming down sight to be able to unlock the foregrip. So uh, obviously that's very, very useful to have some good iron sights to be able to work with, especially when you first pick up the game. Now, uh, also the AK-12 shoots quite a bit slower than the VAL-27 and this gives you a huge advantage in terms of recoil at medium to long ranges. Uh, you know, the BAL-27 is going to be able to dump more bullets down range, but the AK-12 is much, much more accurate and it's more powerful per bullet. So I, I just like it in that regard as well, especially, like I said, when you're kind of keeping your back to a wall, exploring the map, it's nice to be able to be accurate at those longer ranges and, and not worry about getting picked off. So uh, yeah, the AK-12 is just, a, it's a beast, man. It's really, really good. So far, it's honestly one of my favorite weapons. I still have a few more to unlock can try out but it's just it's kind of like a jack of all trades gun like it's good on pretty much any map any situation you're gonna be able to take people out with accuracy and in a pretty quick manner so it's definitely a very very good weapon I think you guys are gonna love it make sure you guys equip this thing on your class when you first boot up advanced warfare and and I wish you guys the best of luck thank you guys so much for watching make sure you guys check out all the other videos I put up today as well as all the new ones I'm gonna be putting up in the next couple of hours I will catch you all later check out these two videos screw you and see you yet I'm going to catch you guys later. Peace out.